So now I'm going to ask you a really easy question. Fiduciary, what's up? So obviously it's not a secret um, that we are working on standards of conduct. Um, it's a, it's a critically important area. Um, it always has been, I and mean, when you're talking about Main Street investors and their hard-earned um, savings, um, you know, perhaps it's even more so critically important now that we um, do something in the space. Um, and, you know, Main Street investors' um, relationship with an investment prof professional at any point in time now um, can be governed by so many regulatory bodies, um, and there's, you know, creates market um, place confusion and. Um, so it's important for us to have, um, you know, regulatory coordination in space, and I know Chairman Clayton has talked about that quite a bit. Um, as far as, you know, sort of what we are doing, um, in, in, again, um, Chairman Clayton has made it very clear that there are principles that have to guide what we are, um, what we put together, um, you know, maintaining choice for the retail investor, um, clarity in the space, and, you know, clarity as to the types of relationships and um, the standards of conduct, and again, I go back to the regulatory coordination when you have um, the potential for your relationship to be um, governed by f uh, federal regulators, state regulators, SROs, um, and all of them with different um, different laws, different regulatory constructs, um, that, that's, that's quite a bit in the space. So more to come on that, obviously. It's, a, it's, the, it's the highest priority for, for the division, for sure. So I'm not sure how much detail you can get into, but this morning, um, Commissioner Peirce suggested that there might be some new disclosures, and she also suggested that there might be some guidance. Um, so is that something that you can address? And we don't want you to front run the commission. Well, we do want you to front run the commission, but, but we won't expect you to. I, I will not front run the commission. But you know, when, when we talk about clarity, um, you know, obviously you can read into that that you know, there's some improvements in disclosure that need to, be ha to happen, because how, are you, how else are you sort of dealing with clarity in, in, in the space? So it is a, um, you know, the, the, you know it's, folks are really hard at work to, to bring the best possible recommendation to the commission. Um, it's on our very, very short-term agenda, um, so hopefully you'll be able to look at it yourselves in the, in the near future, and um, we look forward to your thoughts. That's great. So I think the one thing that, speaking on behalf of probably most people in this audience, the one thing that we would want to see is that whatever the Commission proposes, um, there be an opportunity for input from the, from the industry. Um, so we're very hopeful to see that. We're looking forward to, to seeing a proposal or proposals, um, and we are poised to respond, <laughs> poised to comment. There will be the comment process, and we definitely encourage um, all to um, respond and um, engage in the comment process. And in particular, I've said this before, um, you know, especially lawyers in the room, uh, I'm one of them, um, all of three of us, um, we are fantastic at issue spotting and pointing out the problems. Um, as you point out the problems, please also be so helpful if you um, also think of constructive solutions um, that achieve the Commission's uh, articulated policy goals. So problems, great. Sometimes we actually may not you know, see it, but um, solutions would also be wonderful.